Now, in the Kaneshi District Court has committed to trial uh, the court 10 accused persons facing charges of treason felony for allegedly planning to destabilize the country. The magistrate in her ruling said the accused persons have questions to answer after going through the evidence presented to the court by the state. Here's a report by Godfrey Tanam. The charges leveled against them are treason felony, conspiracy to commit treason felony, and abetment of treason. With these charges, the accused persons will be facing the High Court to prove their innocence as they have consistently emphasized since their arrest. According to prosecution, some of the accused persons in their plan to overthrow the government held meetings to decide whether or not to kill the president if they successfully execute their plan. Senior State Attorney Hilda Crick told the court the accused persons also plan to acquire electronic equipment for the purpose of jamming the system of the National Communication Authority to truncate all broadcasting stations except Ghana Broadcasting Corporation. The 10 accused persons denied their involvement in any plan to destabilize the nation, insisting they never knew each other except one or two of them. The prime suspect, Dr. Frederick McPalm, told the court he formed the NGO Take Action Ghana tag to solve various challenges facing society. He said he has since 2018 embarked on outreach programs in the Upper West, Western and Eastern regions. Senior Police Officer ACP Benjamin Agojo said he is innocent of the charge and is surprised that despite the abundance of evidence on the TAC WhatsApp platform, to the contrary, prosecution has charged him with abetment. He accused prosecution and the investigator of having ulterior motive to destroy his career and also gag him. He said it was humiliating for an ASP to prosecute a senior officer like him, indicating that even the IJP drew the attention of the CID to the anomaly. Senior military officer Colonel Samuel Kojo Gamali, after denying his involvement, said his link to the matter is an orchestration by security agencies because of some serious problems within the Ghana Armed Forces which he is aware, adding he has been intimidated and vilified. The magistrate Eleanor Bansboki, after the committal proceedings, committed seven out of the ten accused persons to prison custody. Trial commences on March 6. Godfrey Tanam, TV3 News, Accra.